the West Campus, you know, this is our first opportunity to really uh, bring uh, nursing, particularly the Megan program, to this part of the city. And so uh, uh, having, having the opportunity to bring students to this campus and really deal with some of the state-of-the-art activities and, and work on this uh, part of the city is going to be a great opportunity. Our Megan program is the first of its kind in the state of Michigan. It is master's entry and so it takes students who have a baccalaureate degree outside of nursing and uh, prepares them in an accelerated fashion to be an entry-level nurse with advanced nursing skills in both leadership, um, research, uh, quality and safety, and population health. And so being, having the opportunity to put these students at the bedside and educate them here in this facility is a tremendous opportunity. We think that our location uh, close to several of the suburban hospitals also is an important linkage uh, in order for students to begin to uh, develop their skills and again work in those various areas. Just we have been able to to develop the uh, simulation area and the classrooms here so that students will be able to come in. They can do their uh, learning here and they can stop their learning, go to one of the uh, side tables and work on particular skills such as blood drawing, IVs, physical assessment. We have a state-of-the-art uh, state uh, uh, simulation activities, uh, simulation room which will be fully equipped with us, uh, high fidelity mannequins, um, Hale is his name, and so we look forward to being able to utilize that as well. As the McNichols campus, uh, the College of Health Professions develops some of its own uh, uh, renovations, we are looking to redevelop our own simulation area, make that state of the art, and be able to connect students from McNichols directly to Novi as well to us as our Aquinas campus so that we will be able to enhance interprofessional opportunities, um, opportunities for nurses who work in urban settings, suburban settings, in rural areas to share some knowledge and expertise as we educate them.